We're gonna be trying a four different Stouffer's Bites, basically. These are all new. We got these at Meyer. They were $4.99. Isn't too bad, because each one of them is a, is a multi-piece box. So you get 18 pieces of the classic lasagna bites. You get 17 of the chicken pot pie bites. 14 of the mac and cheese bites and then 13 of the bacon white bacon and white cheddar mac bites and we'll talk about calories and all that stuff in the details of each one of them when we um when i actually get them out of the oven so are the instructions the same i think they're basically the same but we'll look at them really quick so for the uh classic lasagna bites we have to preheat oven to 450 450 450 450 i'm kind of going through all of them um, arrange frozen bites in a single layer at least one inch apart on a baking sheet uh, place an upper rack of a preheat oven bake for six minutes turn over in an additional six minutes so let's see um, six minutes and six minutes six no nine and three for the mac and cheese bites and nine and three for the bacon and white cheddar bites it still ends up being the same time but they want you to leave the mac and cheese bites and the bacon and white cheddar mac bites um, yeah, mac bites on uh, one side for nine minutes and then flip them over. So I'm gonna show you what these look like as we get them out, but then I'm also going to, um, I'll have multiple timers going, a nine minute timer and then flip it over, and then I'll have a six minute timer and flip them over. So this is the lasagna bites. They come in a bag, which is nice because you can, you can get out what you want and seal up the rest of them. So I'm gonna get out, I think two will be enough for um, well, I think I'll get three out just so we, if there's a picture or something that Tammy wants to take. So I'll get three of each. So there's those, and I'll put those in this corner. Here's the chicken pot pie ones. A little lighter in color. Not greatly light, but a little bit lighter. I've never seen a, um, a chicken, a pot pie bite. Um, that's different. I've seen mac and cheese bites, but I've never seen, never seen pot pie bites, so that'll be different. Okay, here's the... mac and cheese bites. They look like chicken nuggets. <laughs> and the last one is the bacon and white cheddar bites. I do like it that they have a pull tab. You can just pull it right open and it's no, no effort to get them out of the, the box at all. Alright, so we're going to get these in the oven and for six minutes or nine minutes and flip them over and then um, do the additional time and uh, we'll be back when they come out. So I thought we would try the, um, what do you want to try first? The, I think just the plain macaroni and cheese bites. Macaroni and bites. cheese bites? Yeah. The macaroni and cheese bites, it says crispy breading stepped with macaroni and creamy cheddar cheese. Three pieces are 220 calories. And it's this one? Yeah. Hmm. I like that. Picture. I do too. Like the Stouffer's frozen macaroni and cheese. Mm. They take that and put it in breading, which is a really good crisp breading. That's del I think it's delicious. It's very good flavor. And it it has a deep fried flavor to it. You can really taste the cheese. It's very good. Mm. Excellent. This is one of Ashley's favorite appetizers to order at the Cheesecake Factory, except she orders it as a meal. Yeah, uh, the macaroni and cheese it. balls. And yeah. That is very good. So you want to try chicken pot pie next? Uh, sure. All right, the chicken pot pie is... That's the light one. Yeah. It is flaky golden crust stuffed with white meat chicken, peas, carrots, and creamy gravy. Um, it is... Four pieces are 190 calories. Ooh, I got a carrot and pea. Well, the best part of pot pie is the crust. Mm. That's a fair representation of a pot pie, isn't it? I do not like the chicken though. The piece of chicken that I got was, um, what do you call that? It's like cartilage. Chewy, like tough? Yes. The, the, I didn't get a piece the of chicken. The carrot so. was cooked, the pea was cooked. It had a good flavor, 
but I did not like, and I think that was probably one in a whole box. I'm sure all the other ones are perfectly Five fine pieces bones. of chicken, but mine had cartilage, and so, like the I said, wasn't good. no, but I do think it has a good flavor. Yeah, it's a good flavor. It really is not dead on pot pie. I mean, it's missing the gravy and the crust, really. It is, but, a, but it's still. Good. It is a good flavor, and that one piece wouldn't keep me from not making the rest of the box right, exactly. or something. But I do. I w did want to tell you that because you might get that. You want to try the bacon one next? Sure. And the bacon is a, a crispy breading stuffed with macaroni, bacon, and creamy white cheddar cheese. Three pieces are 220 calories. And is that this one? Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm, that's good. And the reasons I have halves on my plate is because Tammy's got a picture for you. I took a picture. So you can see it close up. Oh, uh, that is nice. Mm -hmm. It's really nice. The, the cheese is a lighter cheese flavor, mm -hmm. but that helps bring out the bacon flavor. Yes. And the crust is really good too. The bacon tastes like a bacon, like almost like ham. Yeah, it does. It's it very tastes good. a lot like ham. Gull smokiness. But too. I like the, the, the cheddar cheese. It's mm -hmm. very nice. That's, that's very good. Okay, so the last one is the classic lasagna bite. Lasagna. This is crispy breading stuffed with meat sauce and Italian style herbs, mozzarella cheese, and noodles. So there's no, oh, it does have a meat sauce or okay. Uh, five pieces are 230 calories. <laughs> Cheese. How ladylike. Mm, I like the seasonings. That's my favorite one. It reminds me of um, like a chicken parmesan kind of mm -hmm. flavor. It's really it good. It tastes a lot like chicken parmesan. But no, it's the chicken. this yeah, this doesn't have chicken, it has meat. Um so it's really good. Yeah, it, it's delicious. I love, love, love the the red sauce, that mm -hmm. marinara it's sauce. It's good, it's got a good spice to it. It's it's very, very good. It's uh, got a good seasoning to it. It's not spicy like it's hot. No, it's very well seasoned. You taste the red sauce, you taste the meat, and the breading on the outside is really nice. That and the just the plain macaroni and cheese mm -hmm. bites are my two favorites, though. I think they're I very nice. So I ate the rest of my, or some of my macaroni and cheese. Oh, bites. I don't blame you. <laughs> uh, but now you. The bacon one's also really good. You need to know if you're making these for an appetizer for a party, you're going to want to eat these when they're hot. So yeah, you don't want cheese to get cold. No, this isn't the kind of thing that you want to leave sitting in a dish to get caught. I mean, I don't think they would be bad. I just think these are best served right yeah. when they come out of the this oven. Is, this, I don't consider this necessarily... Um, well, I mean, you could have a, a, with parties like out, but you'd have to literally take them out and immediately just give them out. Yeah, this um, would be best for a couple at home watching TV. Yeah, or if you have a bunch of friends come over and you know you're gonna you're gonna bake them, and then all your friends are gonna immediately grab them and go eat them. Right. Like if you're having uh, watching a um, a game a or, game or yeah. if you're playing video games or something like that, that's when these are perfect. Yes, yeah, so this really wouldn't. For a party, because usually for a party, you want to set everything out and have it ready before people get there. Mm -hmm. And people sometimes come in late and straggle in, you know. So this isn't for that. This is really, I agree with you, a game day. Whether it's video games, watching the game on TV, whatever, that mm -hmm. would be perfect for this. You might be able to put them in a crock pot and keep them warm if, if you kept them warm, but I don't know that it would be the same experience. So right. Just know that you could do it. So which would be your top two? Same one. Same one. Yeah, the the lasagna and the, the macaroni and cheese. cheese. But now they're all good. The bacon's really good too. I wish the cheese was a little stronger. That's my only complaint about it. Yeah. And the pot pie bite, eh, it's okay. Yeah, the, I didn't mind the pot pie at all. Yeah, didn't just, mind it at all. Out of the four, that's that one. That would be like the last out of the yeah. four. Yeah. So I hope you enjoyed the video, and thanks for watching.